All right, 10th class, continuing with the CSS properties. Today, I'll be telling you how to insert image in the background, okay? And uh, how to underline the text in colorful way, clear? So I'm starting with the HTML tag and head tag. Here I have used title. Title is uh, CSS topics and I close the title tag. Now here I have, I'm using the style as a tag. I'm uh, creating the web page using the internal style. So type equal to text or CSS. First tag which I'm going to format is body. Up till now, you have learned how to give color in the background of the web page. This is how you can specify color in the background of the web page. Okay. Suppose you want to insert any image. Then the property is background image colon url function inside this url function you type the name of your image which you want in the background type the name of the image which you want in the background you have saved your html file in one folder suppose the image which you want to place in the background of the web page must be in the same folder. Then only this function will work. Aapne jis folder mein HTML ki file ko save kiya hai, usi folder mein aap wo image ko save karenge, jise aap background mein display karwana chate. Got it? Clear? So, here I close the property for this. Then I would like to format H1. Here I am using font family Arial. Or let us take Rockwell. Okay. I am taking font size as uh, 60 pixels font weight i am taking bold font variant i am taking small caps clear got it Then I am taking text align center. Text decoration underline. Now pay attention carefully on this property text decoration underline. It will underline the text whichever to whichever text you have applied this property clear now suppose you want to underline with a particular color okay so you will pass here one value red the name of the color okay Close this. Uh, here I would like to format the list item tag. Font family. Arial. 
font size 40 pixels okay then uh, font style i am taking here italic okay uh, what else you can take here uh, you can take border if you want border width 5 border color blue border style groove color of the font you can take here mm. let it be green color okay am i clear to all so the color of heading you can take as uh, maroon right now here i close the style tag here i close the head tag here i start the body h1 h1 i am giving the heading subjects in science or uh, simple write subjects in science and uh, close h1 then here you take the ol list and in OL list, you type your first is physics. Then you type chemistry. Then you type mathematics. Then you type biology. Then you type uh, next is physical education then you have computer science and last you have is painting okay then here you close your ol finally you close the body tag and finally you close the html tag right now again pay attention to this command i am going to insert image in the background of the web page earlier you used to insert color in the background of the web page okay and uh, right now you are using image in the background of the web page so save this coding i am saving here with the name 10th d image dot html clear now open up your uh, browser uh, your uh, file see here my file is 10th d image in documents the image file which i want to insert in the background of the web page it is also in the same folder this is very compulsory otherwise your image will not be displayed in the browser view okay so remember to save the image in the same folder where your HTML file is. Check it out. Check it out, please. 
uh, image is by default repeated horizontally and vertically in CSS. Okay. When you are inserting image in the background, it is repeated horizontally and vertically. Clear? You can set the repeat property here that how you want your image to be repeated. Background repeat. The property is background repeat. It has following values. Repeat X. It will be repeat along the X axis. Check it out. The image is repeated along the X axis. I just uh, remove these uh, borders. Check it out. Only along the X axis, the image is repeated. If you are taking here value Y, Image is repeated vertically along the Y axis. Clear? And also check this underline. Underline is in red color. Check the underline, please. Underline is in red color. Okay. <coughs> and see the heading small capitals i typed in lower case it has converted the text into small capitals suppose i type s in capital now check the size of s and size of rest of the letters. Have you noticed? 10th D. Size of S is larger as compared to size of rest of the letters. Or you can set other also in the same manner. Check it. Have you noticed or not? Tenth D. Only Isha Pre thumb is up means only one child is there in the class. All right. Now, see the another change. Uh, no repeat. image will just be appearing at the top left corner. No repetition. Okay. And if you say repeat it is the default appearance of repeating both horizontally and vertically. Clear? There is one more property. Background size. The size of the image that is displayed in the background. 
it has three values auto cover contain auto is the default value if you give the value cover see image is covering the entire screen image is covering the entire screen check it carefully have you observed or not 10th class if you are giving value contain see here and uh, if you give auto the normal repetition horizontally and vertically now come to this property underline red one is underline second is the color you want to give there is one more feature you can add to it how you want to decorate it what style you want to give to your line dotted check it underline is dotted in form have you noticed or not please give your feedback fast all of you then you can have wavy line in yellow color you want to have wavy line in yellow color check it is it clear so many styles you can give then you can have here a uh, solid line this is solid you can have double underline see double underlining is there is it clear up till here yes class then you can write here overline check it line is coming over the text line is coming over the text then you can write line through text you can simply give the hyphenated here check it line through it is going in the center of the text text ko cross karke line ja rahi hai clear to all how you can decorate your line uh, underline and all that so it will help you better in your project work clear all right now let us discuss the concept of hyperlinks clear 
head tag. Here I am taking the title tag hyperlinks. I am coming back to HTML. I am quitting some topic. Uh, I am uh, quitting from CSS. Okay. So we are back to the topic of HTML hyperlinks. What is the benefit of hyperlink? Anybody can tell me. What is the benefit of hyperlink? Uh, Bissam has raised hand. Yes, Bissam, please unmute yourself. It links different parts of the web pages headend and it also links different web pages together through a blue text that is underlined. Okay. Who, anybody else? Anybody else? Having some different meaning for hyperlinks? You are on web, one web page. You want to get connected with another web page. Aap ek web page mein ho. Aap second web page ke saath connect karna chate. You can use hyperlinks. Hyperlink is the highlighted text or a word or an image that lets you connect to another web page. There are mainly three types of linking, external, internal, and mail to. Today, I'll be discussing external link. External link means you are in one file. You want to get connected with another file. You click on the hyperlink and it will help you to jump to a different file. Okay. This is external link. In order to perform the linking operation in HTML, we make use of anchor tag, a tag. I am taking here body BG color as silver. Now, three attributes which you will study today in connection to hyperlinks. First is link. The color of the link. I am taking it as white. Let me have here some solid color. Uh, that is uh, green. The color of my hyperlink is white in the beginning. Color of A link. A link is active link. When you will currently click on the link, the color that will appear is the active link. I am giving it blue. Then V link. V-link is the color of the link which you have already visited. I am giving it orange. Okay. So link, A-link and V-link. These three are the attributes of body tag. In CSS, you have studied this point that link act as a tag when you are linking your HTML file with the CSS file in the case of external style sheet. But here you, you notice that link acts as an attribute also of the body tag where you specify the color of the hyperlink. Uh, I am having here heading and uh, I am bringing the heading in the center. Introduction to hyperlinks. Okay, so I'm typing here one send, uh, sentence. Let us start the practice of using hyperlinks in HTML 
there are mainly three types of linking okay uh here you can have external linking internal linking and mail to okay so how to create hyperlinks a tag a tag stands for anchor its attribute is h r e f hyperlink reference the attribute of anchor tag is h r e f hyperlink reference this attribute will take the name of the target web page to which you want to link to aapko jis web page ke sath link karna hai us web page ka naam yahan pe de do okay suppose i want to link with page 1.html i want to get connected to page 1.html right create hyperlink here click here to view and close this anchor tag this is the hyperlink it will be underlined the mouse pointer will be converted to hand shape symbol when you will bring your mouse pointer over it the mouse will be converted to hand shape symbol when you will click on this hyperlink click here to view this web page will get open up okay i close the body tag over here uh, i haven't closed the h3 na so i close h3 also and i close html here let us save this web page in documents 10th d hyperlinks dot html let us see the browser view see Hi, hyperlink is coming in white color the color of the hyperlink right the color of the hyperlink is white because i have specified the white color over here by default 10th class by default the color of the link is blue color of a link is red color of b link is purple okay right now in front of you the browser view is shown i have taken the color of the hyperlink as white okay when you click when you take your mouse pointer over this hyperlink just see carefully the mouse pointer is converted to hand shape symbol am i clear 10th give your response fast by raising your thumb if the concept is clear to all only mehak thumb is up now click here on this hyperlink you get connected to another web page i have not created this web page so this message is coming your file couldn't be accessed okay am i clear up till here now suppose i am giving the link of the page which you have already type uh, created let us see 10th d image tenth d image 
Okay. I click here. Right. Minimize it. See the browser view. See. The moment I click on uh, this hyperlink, you get connected to this web page. Have you noticed the shifting which has been taken place? Have you noticed the shifting? Okay. Okay, I have a question over here. I have a question over here. Why this color is now orange? Raise your hand and tell me the reason for this. Why the color is orange now? Yes, please. Anyone? Anyone who can tell me the reason for that? Four students have raised hand. Uh, okay, Princey, unmute yourself. Princey, please unmute. Are you getting my voice, Princey? I'm asking you to unmute, Bete. I think some technical issue might be there. Uh, okay, Tanya, you unmute yourself. Tanya, your voice is not audible to me. Your voice is not audible to me, Bete. Bisham. Because it's a visited link. Yeah, it is now showing the color of the visited link. Okay, it is now showing the color of the visited link. Clear? Yeah, dekho, active ho gaya. See the color of the active link. The moment I click, it has become active. Okay. Have you noticed all the three uh, type of uh, attributes? Link, A-link and V-link. I again repeat the default colors. The default color of link is blue. Default color of A-link is red. Default color of V-link is purple. Clear to all? This is external link. You get connected to some external web page to some another web page you are on one web page you get connected to some other web page clear and how we create external link with the help of anchor tag we take the href attribute href attribute takes the name of the target web page to which you want to jump to okay and you pass the hyperlink here this is the hyperlink it will be underlined it will be blue in color by default and mouse pointer will be converted to hand shape symbol when you will click on this hyperlink you will get connected to this web page am i clear 